What's going on guys? Welcome back into Broad Street Breaks. Uh, we're gonna do another mail day. Uh, I got a bunch of stuff over here. Uh, let's get to it. Let's uh, see what we got. So uh, just gonna give you guys a little brief preview. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight packages to go through. I went through them real quick and just opened everything up. Um, but yeah, some good stuff that we're about to go through. Uh, let's check it out. Uh, watching the Phils in the background. Obviously, as you guys can tell, I'm a big Phillies fan. Uh, if you guys are a big Phillies fan as well, follow the page. Definitely check in on some of the cool stuff I got. Uh, for example, like this Bryce Harper, Bowman Chrome. Let me zoom this in real quick. <clears throat> this Bryce Harper, Bowman Chrome first. Uh, USA Baseball. I got this at the National this year at AC. Uh, just some of the really cool stuff that I have. A lot of prospect stuff this year, you know, and all the years back. Um, but yeah, let's get this uh, mail day started. Let's do it. You got mail. We got. Uh, we're gonna start off with this. We start off with this guy right here. Um, yeah, a lot of really good deals. Some of them I didn't even get the best bargain in, but uh, this one's definitely a good one. Uh, started off big. Probably should have gone a little smaller. Um, but yeah, might as well start it off big anyway. All right, so let's see who we got. We had a lot that, what was this from? This is a whatnot lot. Uh, you guys can find me on whatnot, Liberty Bell Breaks. Uh, but this one was a $45 lot. So every card you guys see right here I'm about to spend, or I, I'm about to show you, I spent $45 on the whole lot. Uh, really good deal. Shout out my boy, uh, shout out my boy Bodak, Bodak 8 or whatnot. Um, he hooked your boy Liberty Bell breaks up big time. Let's get it. Let's check out and see what we got. Uh, take the little sticky off. Shouts out Liberty Bell breaks. Liberty Bell breaks Alfonso on whatnot, guys. Bryce Harper, Philadelphia, the hot sauce card. Thought this was super sweet. Uh, I knew it wasn't numbered, but definitely something that I'm going to add to the collection. The Bryce Harper Pink Bomb Squad Firework. Not numbered as well, unfortunately, but still a really, really nice card. Um, like I said, guys, this whole lot was $45, so, you know, you guys judge it as you, you please, but I believe that this was a really good deal, especially when we see some of the stuff coming up. We got a Jalen Hurts. The camera's having a hard time adjusting here, this guy's. Let me bring it up to you. Make. Oh, this is fucked up. I'll just do it on the uh, on the extended lens. All right, so the Hertz rookie card out of Diamond Kings, I believe. Chronicles, Gridiron. Two base cards from Hertz. He just threw those in. A little Zach Ertz rookie card. Thought that was super cool. Wanted to snipe that. Uh, Devonta Smith rookie card, base card. And then we got... Let me take this off just real quick. We got the Aaron Nola Heritage Clubhouse Collection with the maroon pouch. Uh, it's not multicolored in any way, but I thought this was really cool. If you guys give me a second. Uh, let's see what I got going on over here. I got this guy right here to add to that collection. I believe this is from, uh, what year is this from? 2020, and then this one would be what, 2019? 2022, actually. Awesome. Yeah, so, you know, building a little collection there for Aaron Nola Heritage Patches. Super sweet. Super cool. All right, on to the next one from that same bag. So, like I said, 45 bucks. Uh, you guys probably peeped it in the beginning, but here we go. This is an Aaron Nola Donner Signature Series rookie card number to 99. Um, not an on card auto, but beautiful auto in itself. Um, I don't know how consistent he stays with that, but that thing is money in the bag. <laughs> that thing is so nice. Uh, Donruss rookie card, number to 99, whole lot for 45 bucks. Couldn't ask for anything more. Guys, get on whatnot. 
you know, check everything out. If you guys need to, scan that code real quick, do a little screenshot. Uh, that'll give you 10 free bucks after your first uh, first auction. After the first auction that you get into, you'll get uh, $10 after you spend uh, your first dollar. Um, I will as well, which I really appreciate. If you guys do that, that would be huge. Um, it never actually works, though. I've had a few friends do it, and it never works. So, you know, maybe uh, it has to happen in mass quantities. Not sure, but... You know, if you guys ever need to check into that, just take that screenshot right there and whatnot. Scan for your free gift. And uh, make sure you check out Liberty Bell Breaks underscore Alfonso25. Uh, let's keep going through the, uh, through the mail deck. Let's go with a little bit of the smaller packages. I was pulling out some of the big guys right off the bat. Got a little excited. Uh, let's get this going. So, what do we got here? Okay. We got the AI rookie card. Um, beautiful card. Really like this one. Uh, just adding to the collection, I got a huge stack of AI. This one's from 97, though, so this was one I never had was the basketball leather on it. Um, I cannot tell. You know, I took a peek at this. I cannot tell if, you know, it's hard to even tell when it's, in the top loader, but I can't tell if that is wear and tear on the card or if it's got this like you should see it. They look like polka dots, but it might just be wear and tear on the card. So, unfortunately, this isn't anything special, but none of my AIs really are. They're just basically for PC. So, that was really cool. Um, definitely don't think I paid too much for that. Uh, probably check in on eBay now and make sure I didn't uh, go too high on that. If I did, I'll give myself a slap on the wrist. My gosh, that fucking TV was so loud. All right. Uh, eBay loads. Move on to the next one. No, Ben, please. <laughs> no Ben please thank you for that uh, uh, even though when I looked into my mailbox this was the only one that was like this <laughs> just stuck in there like that because you know if a mailman see this he's probably like fuck you <laughs> just kidding shout out to all the mailmen getting all these packages out there y'all hustle I appreciate that okay we got ourselves a Nicky Maton, auto. This kid's uh, just basically signed himself into the starting lineup, uh, solidified himself into the starting lineup. Uh, I think it's super, super cool that uh, I got this auto before that even happened. So it came in just in time. Uh, I got another one on Whatnot that I paid a little bit more for this one than I did for this one. This was actually a really good deal. Um, like when I say good deal, I mean absolute steal. But, uh, yeah, you know, not numbered or anything, not on card. Just figured I'd get myself one for the PC. One for the boys. All right. Next one. Next one here. Okay, so this one, you know, like stocks, you buy cards when they're low. And he just got hurt. You know, he was on fire for a little bit. I saw this card posted from someone else for a little bit more. It might have been a different variation, but it was posted for a little bit more. I got this card for an absolute steal. Number to nine ninety nine. Um, it is super, super, super crispy too. You know, for grading purposes, if this dude ends up taking us uh, to World Series, or if we end up going to World Series and he ends up being our like big prime time closer, um, this would be a really sick card to end up having. Uh, he's hurt right now, but he will be back in five days, they say. So, no, not five days. They said somewhere around September 1st. Not far. Out of boy, Sir Anthony. Keep it going. Keep it going. On to the next one. This one's a little bit bigger here. Okay, these are for my boys on whatnot. Oh, hey now. Good thing you left a, a wall of cardboard there. These are from my boys on whatnot. <clears throat> um, I actually didn't go through this one yet because I have a pretty good idea what is in there. But um, yeah, there it is. Shout out Liberty Bell Breaks, Alfonso, and whatnot. Check it out, guys. 
check it out and subscribe here on youtube uh, i'm new here but i'm just giving it a shot for you know on my downtime i do stuff like this while i open up mail uh, i've seen a couple other people do it so before we start getting into this let's see uh what the damage was 32 dollars 31 dollars $31 damage, so this is going to be a nice lot when when you spend $31 on whatnot with the guys that I roll with. You're usually getting something good out of it, so. Let me shout out my boys. Uh, forget their names. Swizzle. Shout out Swizzle on whatnot. Um, he hooked us up with some uh, really, really cool cards, so let's get through it. We got the Alec Bomb Bowman Select. Franchise 2020, really cool card. No stats on that, so I guess you consider this a rookie card. Um, but really cool variation that I did not have. Also did not have the Bryce Harper Tops Black Gold. Uh, it's not numbered. Normally they are, um, but it is not numbered. And uh, I'm still happy to add it to the collection. Didn't have that one before. And if I did, I think it might have been like a paper variation of some sort, but not that. Tyrese Maxey, 76ers. Are, I'm not sure. I'm not good with the uh, basketball cards. I'm not going to lie. But, um, you know, drop a comment if you know what I'm, uh, what I'm holding here. I know it's the orange variation of something. But, you know, it's a nice card. And I did not have it for Maxey. Um, so, I figured I'd grab that. You know, like I said, this whole lot came out to like $31. So, pretty good deals already so far for those cards i'd say those cards price out to about six dollars in my mind so we're, we're we're there we got a kenneth gainwell rookie card didn't have this yet even though i have a lot of these base cards i did not have this set so i wanted to add that to the collection and then one of the bigger ones that i wanted to add was the mick abel bowman inception card so this card's thick but he had it in really good condition i had him put him up to the cameras uh, there's one turn, not turned quarter, but one softer edge, I'd say. But these cards are really hard to keep safe. But uh, you know, I'm going to get these in a top loader immediately. And uh, yeah, just a really, really, really cool card for Mick Abel. Um, if you guys don't know who he is for Phillies, he's a our number two prospect now, even though he's a little bit older than Painter. But Painter's turning out to be like a really, really, really great prospect. You know, he's only 19 years old and he's six foot seven. Uh, he's an absolute animal. Uh, he just pitched his first game at Double A and absolutely fucking killed it. Um, yeah, he threw in another Veerling rookie card, and then uh, he threw in a Alec Baum rookie debut Gold Cup card. Uh, I actually had this already, but he threw it in. Um, okay, these are what basically brought the price up in a lot of it. I I'd say we're already probably about at. $13 for this one probably about 13 maybe 16 at the most depending on how you value that but so I wanted to add a Noah, Noah Syndergaard to the uh, collection we got him right here on the mound which is super cool check that out go ahead ditch it up out of way um so we got Noah on the mound right now I figured I wanted to add him to the collection I couldn't find anything that was affordable um as an angel because i think the price skyrocketed a little bit once he became a philly knowing our market um but so i went after the one in a mets uniform which not like me not a big mets guy but only reason that sold me is this is a ben's baller tops card and when i saw that i said throw it in it is numbered to 75 and when i knew it was going to be numbered when i saw it, i had a bb on it um big fan of ben baller um super sick card so definitely don't matter that the uh, mess logo is on there for me right now because that was like uh it was just cool to get the ben baller card that's my second ben baller card and that's it so that you'll, you know obviously what that means it's literally the only two that i have and fucking extremely excited to add that excuse my language actually definitely can't mark this as a uh kids friendly video all right next up the real reason that the uh, price was high on this $31 lot. If this car gets graded, we're looking at easily $120. This is a number to 99 Panini Prism, Joel Embiid, Blue Cracked Ice. And the centering is immaculate. Thick, thick. Whole ball, hands not cut off. 
they both have really good space to the bottom. These two uh, triangles right here have really close or thick uh, bottoms. This this card is just perfect. So that was uh, the thirty-one dollar lot from whatnot. Like I said, guys, get on there, find your guys that you can get your steals from. The dudes who live in Alaska and care nothing about Philadelphia and grab everything that you can from them because these things are beautiful. Um, so, so far, so good. Um, we're definitely underneath $100 still, I believe. Um, but we're definitely floating around there in the $90 range. So let's see what else we can grab. We're definitely going over that, that's for sure. All right. So the damage on this one is uh, significant, and we're definitely getting over that uh, hundred dollars. So we spent, uh, we spent, spent seventy-seven dollars on this one. And I remember, <clears throat> as I pulled the trigger on this, I wasn't too happy with myself, but you know, it is what it is. <laughs> it is what it is. I. I hopefully can do something with it the lot itself is nothing special there's just about one card we got i added one to the pc and this one right here the alec bomb number one prospects let's see if we can get us back in here sorry guys i apologize big time for this oh boy there it goes Nope, not going to do it for me. Okay. There we go. That'll bring you guys in there. Alright. So we're just going to ride a little zoomed in here. Sorry for that 20 second delay. Bobby Witt Jr. Pro Sets Prospect. And then I grab myself the Flash Photography, Leaf, Bobby Witt, Numbered Auto. Number to 99. Low numbering. Great condition card. Whole lot, three cards for $77. We're definitely going to attempt to sell this i believe if there's a bobby witt auto that i want it's the first um i tried very hard to pull it but in breaks but it didn't end up working out so yeah um i was happy with at least getting something like this and we'll see what i can do with it um i'm flirting with i'd probably do this for like 150 dollars on ebay after all the fees on fee ebay it's just something that i think i can pull off um, all right closing in on the last two packages here and we're closing in on the last two minutes before this video becomes ridiculously long um yeah so let's see what we can do all right so we got the no uh no pack no papering in this package so no shipping label no nothing like that i really hate when guys and whatnot do that so i can't credit them and I don't want to because, um, yeah, screw them for not putting that in. So Charles Bassey signed rookie card. The auto is awful, um, but, you know, super sweet steal. And then the clearly Donruss rookie, ra rated rookie, um, just super sick card. I mean, didn't have one of these before. Um, and now that I do have one of these, I will be selling one of my rated rookie optics. If you guys are interested, hit me up on Instagram at Broad Street Breaks. Broad, broad street breaks underscore in between the words. So, great cards added there. Now this one, I haven't popped open yet because this is a big boy. Um, ended up, uh, hopefully I didn't get that on there in this video, but yeah, big boy. We, uh, we done dropped ourselves. $17 on this one. So, 
seventeen dollars is a steal for what you guys are about to see. Shout out my boy. It's only cards on whatnot. Check them out. Cause these are no joke. The steals that he gives for seventeen dollars. Guys, if you're looking to add to your collection, get on whatnot. Look at that. Look at that product for 17 bucks. Oh my god. The amount of cards we're about to go through, guys. All right, it's unbelievable. And I know for a fact I was working him. He has this thing going, so <clears throat> he uh, he will start you off with your lot, your team. And as you continue to bid higher, dollar by dollar, he'll continue to throw at least seven cards in at a time. Hence why there's this much in here. They're all, you know, not all of them are going to be nice, but he will, out of nowhere, he'll be like, come on, get us up to $7. $7, I'll we'll start getting to the color. And he's really good at it. He's got some sleight of hand, that's for sure. Because, uh, you know, I thought I was buying the nice ones and I didn't end up pulling the trigger any longer. But uh, I got a couple steals out of it. Um, we're about to see. We're about to see. It'll be uh, news to me and you. Um, I'm excited. Start off with the first pack and start with the top. Start with the rookie card of Darnell Sweeney. I have absolutely no idea who Darnell Sweeney is, even as a Phillies fan. Okay, we got a nice, nice Mike Schmidt Leaf 1987 card. Great condition. Beautiful card. Bobby Abreu. Got a Bobby Abreu upper deck. Uh, from 2001, Boom Chrome or uh, Boom Cup card, Wilson traded, uh, uh, Mike Lieberthal, beautiful, love Mike Lieberthal, got this card, that's for sale, <laughs> uh, JP Crawford, that's sick, I'm definitely gonna keep that, that's his rookie card, uh, Boom rookie, that's a new insert, uh, Boom, Jake Thompson, JT Realm Muto, nice, new age performers. Bryson Stock Chrome Prospect. Uh oh. 14 minutes of one of my auctions on eBay ends. Damon Jones, Bowman first. Enley, Enley De Los Santos, rookie card. Spencer Howard, prospect card. Jorge Alfaro, rookie card. Reese Hoskins. Another Mike Schmidt. Nice. Nice. Now I can do some work with that. That's awesome. Damon Jones first again. Luis Garcia, absolutely killing it in the minors for the for the fills just absolutely murdering it i got two two more of his chrome a bunch of his paper throw those around tommy her another mike schmidt in perfect condition man i gotta check the centering and see which one of those is best might have to get one of them graded tyler goodell never heard of him but why does this look like a newer card 16 no yeah, it's good condition never heard of him aaron nola Scott Kingery, Future Stars, Frank Baker, another Mike Schmidt, and this one, oh, it doesn't have the, uh, there's a certain variation you're supposed to look for, I forget what it's called. Drop a comment in the bottom if you know, spread some knowledge. Diamond Kings, Richie Ashburn, from 2020, it's different. Steve Carlton, 1970s tops from 2020. Lenny Dykstra, Mickey Morandini. Kurt Schilling, Dale Murphy, Mickey Williams, rest in peace, I don't know where that boy's at, Franchise Feet, Steve Carlton from 2019, and a Donruss Kings Optic, Aaron Nola, cool one to add to the collection, wish that was numbered, um, like I said, I... I ran these auctions up so high, but just didn't pull the trigger on like going towards like the 10 to $13 range, which really would have paid off. And I really should have done it, but I was so deep on these whole lots. Obviously, as you can tell, this is a big mail day. And uh, yeah, I was just too deep. He was the last stop, unfortunately. 1987 highlights from Mike Schmidt. You know, you never get any Shane Victorino out of any of this. And that sucks. I love Shane Victorino stuff. Okay. I love all vintage Philly stuff. I mean, I love collecting like numbered Chase Outlet cards and stuff like that. They're just so rare. JD Martinez, 
Garrett Richards, David Ortiz. I got this lot. This is a Boston lot. I got this for the David Ortiz cards that you're going to see. And the Manny Ramirez, Connor Wong, Clemens. This was really cool. This was a nice card. Manny, Manny, Pedro, Pedro. Michael Shivas. Number, Mo Vaughn, David Ortiz, and then Marcelo Mayer, Bowman, Mojo. Yeah, probably, uh, I might have regretted that one right there. That one was a regret. Bye. I just need, I needed to get things going in the chat. Just need to get sparse wine. Beep. People love me on there, man. I'm a, I'm an easy sell for Phillies cards. I just say Philly, and they're like, oh, I got Philly. DD. You know, I don't know what DD's future is like here in Philly, but it was nice to have him, so I'll probably keep that card around. Reese again. Al Simmons. Nikki Williams. Alec Asher. Suarez, rookie card. That's nice. Bryce Harper. I don't know if I have that variation. Honestly, and that's a base card, but I don't know if I have that. Spencer Howard, long gone. Stott, rookie. Roman Quinn. RBI leaders, Ryan Howard, David Wright, Adrian Gonzalez. Another Luis Gonzalez, or Garcia. Alec Bohm, rookie card, with the uh, green frame. Eagles frame. That's cool. Another Luis Garcia prospect. Spencer Howard. Steve Carlton, Ranger Suarez with the 150 patch on it. McCutcheon 150 patch. Damon Jones first again. Luis Garcia's with the digi camo. Actually, that is not the digi camo. I can't, I can't say that. Um, not sure. Just a green variation. Spencer and Alec. Aaron O'Double. Like I said, guys, $17 for this whole thing. Can't be too disappointed. There's no sparks flying, that's for sure. But uh, hopefully there might be something snuck in here. Usually guys like to uh, hook it up sometimes, but it is what it is. Who you got on there? Reese? I was like, who? I, I don't see anybody. Jim Tomey. Jim Tomey not numbered. I thought he said he dropped a Jim Tomey numbered in there, but that's weak. Chris Oliver, no idea. 2014, that's why. 2019 rookie stars, Deli and Santo, Enley De Los Santos, and Ranger Suarez. That's a really cool card. Of course, not numbered. Jose Pujols. Jake Arrieta. Sir Anthony Dominguez. There we go. There we go. Something to add to the connect collection. Gene. I like Gene cards. Jim Bunning. Somebody might have to educate me on Jim Bunning. Is he a Philly? Yeah, he was a Philly. Lenny Dykstra. Roy Holiday Select. That's a nice card to add. Take that one. JD Hammer. Really was hoping for more from JD, but he's making no, uh, no noise, that's for sure. Another JP rookie card. Another Enley card. Cam Perkins Bowman first. No idea who Cam Perkins is. It's a shame. Sixto Sanchez. Jojo Romero. Sixto Sanchez. Like Miami Marlins, Sixto Sanchez? Is that who he gave for JT Romito? I think it is. Jojo Romero. Emily again. Nice. You got the uh, Aaron Nola opening day insert. That's nice. Blue insert. Reese, Jake Thompson, rookie card, Nick Williams again, Cam Rupp, no idea, Richie Ashburn from how long? Yeah, that's a 2019 card. I knew that thing was way too nice for what it is. Steve Carlton, Cruck, Harper again, Luis, Luis, Spencer, Williams, Veerling, Harper. All right, so it was weak. Not a single number card in there? God damn. $17, that was rough. I just took that man's base off of him. Start fire with it. I'm just kidding. Just kidding. Um, Alright, so a couple more things. I know it's a freaking long video, but freaking long video, but um, just wanted to show a couple more things off. 
Uh, something to go with that Noah Syndergaard uh, that I've been doing is just adding some of these uh, some of these new guys to Philly. Um, and this one I just wanted to show off a little bit. This is the Nick Castellanos Bowman First Chrome. Uh, got lucky, and this is numbered to 500, so it's a refractor number to 500. Uh, crispy corners, great condition, super great buy. I know I got that first deal. Um, and then I was going through my older cards, um, and I ended up finding the Tony Gonzalez draft pick. And it is hard for me to keep my older cards. I've moved about 100 times, not realistically 20, but... Um, this thing is just immaculate. It was in one of the binders, dude. It was in like a two sleeve. Um, it, it's just it's just in really good condition. So really hyped about that. Also found the Eddie George draft pick card. So that thing's just as in good in just as good condition, and it's got like some Topps Chrome Prism type print to it. So it's really cool. Um, also, update on the Topps Now collection. Um, you know, I don't have money pouring out of my pockets, so I can't always get these cards as much as I want to, but when they go on eBay for cheaper than they sell on the Topps website, I end up, I end up sneaking a couple of them out. Um, and specifically, I'm going for all of the Bryson Stott ones, and I believe I'm like one or two behind, but, uh, you know, they give these cards to specific players, like only about like four players a week or no maybe it is a day yeah four players a day get like a tops now card and it's from whatever they did the game before check it out on tops.com um so this bryson style one was the first one of the year this is from um four eight four six um and this is rookie post multi-hit game in mlb debut um that was really sick and then you got the bryce harper drives in career run home run for graves First MLB home run is in a three-run shot versus the Angels. Oh, yeah, this was not a home run. Career run, career high five runs. Um, and then this is the Bryce Harper eighth inning grand slam. So, all really cool. Um, you know, Bryce obviously hasn't had one in a while, but I keep getting the Bryson ones as they go. Pulled this out of a Topps Wild Wild Pack. Um, yeah, just... Uh, you know, the Manny Machado's here uh, because I won this home run challenge, so I'm waiting to get the confirmation back. And uh, yeah, it took a lot, of, took a lot of thought to get that one in. I picked the game, the weather, looked looked everything up. I'm not from their area, so it was really hard. Um, I had to pick a game, and they ended up being at home. Went right over the left field fence. So I'm glad I didn't double down for 425. That shit only went like 412 or like 3 390 if that. So. Uh, that was really cool guys thanks for checking in that was a shit ton of cards that we just went through for mail day um check that out that's a stack um yeah like i said um i'm gonna leave a link in the description uh for all of my social medias that you guys can reach out to but you know if you you know if you like what you guys saw uh you know the videos are gonna get better as they go I'm new here but you guys want to give me a subscribe that'll definitely give me some motivation to keep it coming on here i definitely like doing youtube videos are a lot more simple than going on like uh facebook instagram or tiktok and streaming there that's just a little too hectic for me so this is nice just to like get it all in one video post it all up oh and uh good thing i didn't let you guys go because about Whatever the draft was, about a week later, I grabbed one of these. I figured these would be perfect if I get any of the good players from the draft. Um, because the, all, the age groups vary all over the place with the kids that you can pull from 2022. You can literally pull some 13-year-olds. But I got really lucky, unlike usual, and I pulled a Drew Jones rookie patch auto. Not a rookie, a prospect patch auto. 18U Amer uh, USA Baseball. Uh just a beautiful card everything's mint i went literally from box to top loader i was freaking out when i pulled it i'll probably post that eventually here on youtube um if i can get my hands on the footage but yeah it's freaking awesome um yeah guys so thanks for checking in like i said check out uh instagram broad street breaks whatnot you can find us liberty bell breaks 
Uh, that's the logo. Look for the uh, light blue Liberty Bell when you guys get on there. Scan that code. Screenshot this. If you guys want free bucks off your uh, first purchase, or free $10 after your first purchase. Um, and yeah, guys, I guess the only two things I didn't show you guys yet are uh, this Volpe 9.5. This would be sell. This would be for sale this time next year. And the uh, Jason Dominguez, which probably maybe this time next year, maybe not. The Yankees are so stacked. Um, but yeah, so thanks for checking in, guys. Uh, you know, whenever you guys get a chance, you know, check out the other videos on the page. Uh, and if you're ever interested in, you know, what I have for sale, hit me up on Instagram. That's the easiest way to do it. So thanks, guys. Have a good one.